Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Vivian. Happy birthday to you. Do you know what your mother's Korean name is? Uh, Who knows? Ask her what it is. Uh, what's your name in Korean? Sarah. No, it's Su Jung. Can you say that? Su Jung. Yeah, so that's, and you know what it means in Korean? It means crystal. Isn't that cool? Yeah. It means crystal. Okay, but I don't know how to write it in Korean, and I don't think your mommy does either. Okay. I did. Now let's let Victor have a turn to read. I did not want to learn a new way. I wanted to go back home in Korea. I did not like America. Everyone was different here. He showed us how to print every letter in your pencil, and his eyes said, "Though as Do I do as I say." He showed me how to print every letter in the English alphabet. So I practiced, and my father was very pleased. Look, I, he calls my mother. See how well you did little you in this? Yes, she said. She will be a wonderful student. I wrinkled my nose. Ooh, she wrinkled her nose. She's not happy in the new country, is she? If you had to go to a new school and you didn't quite understand the language, would you be a little scared? There you go, Ken. Well, I am, but I don't Probably, yeah. Oh, no, okay, I'm going to read this next one, and then Vivian can read. My okay. first day at school, I sat quietly in my desk while the teacher talked about C-A-T. She wrote cat on the chalkboard. She was supposed to do write her name, huh? I did not want to write Yoon. I wrote cat instead. I wrote cat on every line. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think the teacher thought about that? I wanted to be cat. I wanted to hide in a corner. My mother would find me and cuddle me up close. I would close my eyes and mew quietly. <laughs> she would have it. Do you think she was happy that first day at her new school? How do you think she felt? <laughs> kind of scared? Yeah. Okay, who wants to read this time? The teacher looked at my paper. She shook her head and frowned. You're sad, so you're a cat, she asked. The ponytail girl sitting behind me giggled. After school, I, I said to my father, we should go back to Korea. It is better there. Do not type, talk like that. He said, America is your home now. Oh, why do you think she said that? Because she didn't want to <laughs> She didn't want to stay in America. Where did she want to go? Korea. Back to Korea. Back to Korea because she, was, she knew that country. She didn't know this, did she? <gasps>